This is a user review of the Razer Lancet wireless or wired mouse. It costs $109 on Amazon. It has RGB lighting that changes with all different colors, which is really cool. It's a it's not an optical mouse, it's a laser mouse. It has a polymer a lithium battery built inside the mouse for charging it. Comes with a cable so you can use it wired or wireless. It takes about four hours to charge it the first time you uh, uh, want to set it up. You have to charge it for four hours. It's got a little hole in the bottom where you can put your transceiver. And it's made for left or right hands. So it's not, it doesn't matter if you're right or left hand, it will work for either hand. So the buttons are already pre programmed for your browser for back and forward dealings, but you can change them in the software. You can also change the way the color schemes go in the software too. There's, there's different multiple um, uh, selections of uh, how you want the colors to appear. Or how you want them to, uh, to 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 change. Uh, it's a uh, sixteen thousand DPI mouse. You can set the DPI settings here or here. The reason why I bought this mouse is I need a new mouse. And I wanted to match my keyboard. My keyboard on my MSI computer is an RGB keyboard and it changes colors. And I wanted a mouse that would change colors as well. And this one fit the bill. So I'm using it for video editing. Now my question to you is, would you spend $190 for a video editing mouse? This is actually a gamer mouse, but I'm using it for video editing. So would you spend 190 bucks for a mouse for video editing, or am I just nuts? I'm probably both. I'm probably nuts, and I just love the color scheme. I like that it's wireless or wired. When you're using it in wireless mode, after 10 minutes of inactivity, it will shut off by itself, so it'll save battery life. comes with software that you can adjust all your settings, reprogram the buttons, like you said reprogram the color schemes. It's a good mouse. I like it. The build quality is nice. When you look at it on Amazon it looks like it's all black but it's not. It says gunmetal gray and black sides. Black rubber sides. So that's the most I'm using right now for my video editing. Am I crazy buying this mouse for 190 bucks for video editing? I don't know. I just love the color change. And I like it that it's wireless as well. I like it that it matches my keyboard up there. My keyboard changing colors. And so does the mouse change colors too. So I mainly bought it as a toy. That's Basically, why I bought it as a toy. You don't need a hundred ninety dollar mouse for video editing. Uh, I was using a for a Microsoft uh, four thousand mouse before. I think I paid uh, twenty five bucks for it or thirty five bucks for it. And that's what I was using before. But now I'm using this one here for my video editing. So, anyways, that's what I'm using for my mouse. If you have any comments? Leave a comment in the below, in section there below. What kind of mouse you use? What kind of gaming mouse you use? If you're a gamer, what kind of gaming mouse you use? Do you like Razer or do you like Logitech or what? What brand of mouse mouse uh, do you like? So that's about it. Because I, I think I'm not sure if I said this is a this is a not a optical mouse. This is a laser mouse. It's a laser, not optical. So leave a comment section in the comment section below 
on what you think of the mouse. And thanks for watching.